Hello and welcome to more Cave Story! We're inside the sand zone right now and trying to figure out where to go. We have that health upgrade up there, but I was not able to figure out how to actually get up there. I'm not sure if I'm missing something or if we just have to get there at another time, but for now we're just gonna drop down and try not to get wrecked by these nerds. I guess they respawned because we went inside that other place last time. But we're just gonna try to go across this way and see what we can do for ourselves. Oh, make it, yeah! Okay, don't get killed by bones. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we're looking pretty good here. Let's see if we can kill these guys before they get to us. Yep. Yeah. Oh, not quite. We're down to only level two on this weapon. Oh, crud, I thought I killed it. Oh, gosh, that health upgrade would be really good right now. All right, this time I'm gonna be smart and just throw my fireballs up from here and hope they drop some HP for me. Yeah! All right, let's grab that health. I'm actually up to six, so they'll still one-shot me if I get damage. Except for the bones. I think the bones only do four, but the main bodies of the guys, I believe, do eight damage, so that's not gonna go so well. Let's see if we can max out my missiles right here. And let's try using these missiles to take these guys down a little bit more quickly. Yeah, that worked out pretty well. Okay, so let's grab the health. Off to a pretty bad start in this episode, but we're bringing it back, guys. Don't even worry. Okay, let's go down here. I think I just want to kill these guys. Not even going to try to jump with them in the way. These are like... Oh, gosh, they're still alive! I thought they were dead! You cruds! Uh, safety! Go to safe weapons! Oh, my gosh, there's so many! Get the health! Get the health! Oh, gosh, more health! Yes! I'm actually at more health than I was, somehow. Let's see if I can keep killing these guys. I can't quite reach that health, but I can get that one. Sick. Uh... Gosh, what do I do from here? I guess just lose all my bubble power. You have got to be kidding me. These stinking birds, dude. Well, let's go back. Am I dead? No, I'm not dead. Okay. What the crud? I guess there's a secret path down here. That or it's just one block missing. Okay, let's jump over the spikes and read the sign. Sandzone has walls that can be passed through easily. Look for markings on the walls. So I guess when they're transparent like that, you can go through. So maybe we can jump through here. Yeah, I got it. Okay, so we've kind of got the uh, gimmick figured out here. With that knowledge, let me go back to where the uh, the dog thing was, and let me see if I can get that health upgrade, actually. I can see at the top right there's some more of that transparent stuff, but from down here I just don't see any way to get up there. There's no transparent part leading to that, so... Yeah, I'm stumped on that one, guys, so my bad if you can actually get that now, but I just can't figure out how to. Okay, so let's go back up here and see if we can actually make it across. I think we do have to go around again, because... Well, we fell, and I don't see any way to get up on the other side. But the enemies are not back. The enemies in this game seem to only respawn if you go inside a building or something like that, or if you die, so... As long as we don't do one of those things, I think we'll be good to go. But the birds are still here, because we did not finish them off. Let's see if I can take out a few of them, at least, with this. Now, let's go over to some missiles. I just want to get these guys taken care of, so let's use all my missiles just to kill these guys. Kind of missed one right there, but I think we got them. Uh, not quite. Oh, gosh, we're empty! We're empty! Let's see if I can get all these healths on the way. And I think I can jump back up from this spot. Oh, just don't fall into the death spikes. Can we jump on that column? That's a very important question here. Let's see if we can get this bird killed first. Okay, we got that guy, so we're gonna jump. Can we land on this? We can, awesome. I was so afraid I was gonna jump into those spikes and die. Over here, we've got a little dog dude just taking a nap. Can we go inside here? It is locked. No, we can't. I think we have to jump on these blocks to get across here. Let's go talk to Mr. Doggy. And he's just taking a uh, little nap here. Do you want to bring him along? Sure. Picked up the dog. What the heck? Well, we've got a dog hat. Yo. Ooh, here we go. We've got a health point and a save point. That's exactly what I needed. Let's see if we can go up these paths. No, it does not look like it. I'm thinking... Oh, let me try right here. Oh, hold on. Go up in there. No, I don't think we can go in there. I'm going to try taking this guy back to where... Once again, where that health upgrade was. Because there were dogs over there. So maybe bringing this dog is going to make it safer for us. As long as we don't jump into spikes. Okay. Bottom path is going to be the safe one here, because top the ceiling was kind of covered in spikes. So let's just keep going. I think the place I'm trying to get to is right over here. So let's not get killed by those buttheads. Just jump right across. Jump right down there. Okay. We're almost there. Just don't fall. I think it was right up here. So let's go see if this is the right way to go now. So we still don't have access to that treasure as far as I know, but if we go inside here, can we make our way to safety? Let's drop down another save before I jump into this little pit here. Oh, the ceiling is kind of blocking me. Let's go over here. Is there another way? Oh! Oh my gosh, this entire time there's been another path. Can I get across to that dog? I cannot! Okay, let me just kill this thing first. It's still not dead. Gosh dang it. Die, you crud! No! This is a death trap, dude. Okay, we've got the guy killed at least, so while I'm not doing very good, hopefully I can just at least avoid death. So let me find out if there's any way I can get to that dog there. Is there any more secret paths I can take? There's gotta be some way to light this room up or something. Because this is not making much sense here. Let's make it across to the dog, you crud! Aha! It seems like there's something up here. Yes, we can make it across! There was another secret path. Woof, woof, woof! You can't take two with you. Oh, gosh. 
Was I supposed to do something with these dogs and I forgot about it? Gosh dang it, this is the problem with taking breaks between gaming sessions. Well, I have just died, but we're back to full health now, which is good. I'm gonna try to figure out what to do with these dogs. I know it's probably frustrating, guys, but I really genuinely have, like, a really bad memory. Like, just this morning, I took something out of the fridge and then made breakfast, and then I completely... Like, it just was completely off my radar. I didn't even realize I left stuff out on the counter. Like, I left, like, four Tupperware dishes out on the counter, and I just didn't even realize I did that until Clubby saw it later. Like, my memory is just so bad. I don't think it's, like, any kind of, like, diagnosable mental, you know, brain issues or anything. I think it's just a case of, you know, forgetfulness, but... Yeah, it happens a lot with me. I'm gonna try going back to Jenka's house. Maybe this is where we can drop off the dogs. Hey, Jenka. Oh, oh, that's my dog. Okay, guys, we figured it out. Game for the dog. I don't recall them ever saying that's something we had to do, but they might have. I just, I genuinely can't remember. That was very nice of you. What? The red flower? Oh, yeah. Oh, gosh dang it. This guy again. We've already fought him three times, I think. Oh, it's you, Barog. You look good. How's my stupid daughter been lately? Ha! Stupid daughter, you mean misery. She's also fine. A new master has appeared. This time, the surface will finally be ours. Are you still, still trying to do that? I'm not here to cause any trouble. I just came by to pick up the keys to the warehouse. You know, the warehouse with the flower seeds. Ah, so this is a warehouse with the flower seeds we gotta look out for. Huh? I have no idea what you're- Hey, whoa, that's my line! I have no idea what you're talking about, Balrog. Is that so? You're just pretending that you don't know. Hmm? I see now you're going to betray us then. Is that it? Oh, crud. You'll be sorry. Oh, jeez. Do we have to fight them again? Now I guess we're just going to leave. A new master. It must be another idiot at it again. About my dogs. I have four more still, my little pups. But these legs of mine are so very weak. Sorry for the inconvenience, but would you mind finding the rest of my dogs for me? Well, there's one of them. I know where one other is, so let's go get that one at least, and we'll try to find the other three. Okay, here we've got the second dog, so let me see if I can bring that back to the lady as well. All right, here's the second dog. You're fast. This is certainly one of my beloved little dogs. Gave her the dog. By the way, you must be a soldier from the surface. It's been a long time since all those robots just like you came to this island. They were responsible for the deaths of so many defenseless Mimiga, and for the lives of the brave men and women who tried defending the Mimiga. Due to effects of consuming the forbidden red flower, the uh, corner of Mimiga became utterly rabid. They fought back viciously against the robots that had invaded their island. Who knows, had there been no red flower, it's very possible that the Mimiga on this island might have been annihilated. Three more left. I know you can do it. So we've got to find three more dogs. It sounds like we're going to get some backstory here whenever we do that. But let's keep looking. I think I'm going to try backtracking a little bit and see if we can find anything that we might have missed. That's kind of the only thing I can think to do right now. Unless there is some way over to the right. Oh, right here, there's actually a dog paw print. So we've seen that that's a place you can go to. So maybe we can sneak in right here. And let's see if this will give us anything good. Well, it's, we're sneaking down. Maybe this is where we finally get that health upgrade. Let's keep going. And it looks like it will be. Yo, here we go. And that chest is shaking, which means it might have... A dog inside let's find out and inside here we have it is indeed a dog okay so let's take this back to her we've got to look out for those dog paw prints because this might indicate where the dogs themselves are so let's go back and take this to the old lady hey lady we've got dog number three who definitely that's one that one's mine gave her the dog thank you so much this one makes three have you ever seen an enraged Mimiga? Eating the red flower will make me stronger. A great many of the Mimiga believed this and chose to eat the red flower. Then, and only then, did they fight back against the battalions of robots. But, do you know what happens afterwards to a Mimiga filled with such a rage? It was so terrible. Perhaps they couldn't control themselves. Well, most of the Mimiga who consumed the red flowers were never to be seen again. They went missing. I heard a rumor that they supposedly made it down to the surface where the humans live down to the surface? What the? That's weird. The thought of the enraged Mimiga anywhere close to the surface with humans. If it's really true, do you yet realize it? Do you realize how dangerous the red flower actually is? Two more pups. All right, two more. I'm gonna continue my backtrack here and see if we can find anything else. Wow, there's a health upgrade up. Haven't I been this way before? Have I missed that health upgrade last time? What the heck is wrong with me if I did? All right, let's go get that at least, and I'll keep looking for some more dogs as well. All right, here we go. We're gonna get this health upgrade right here, which I need as many of these as I can get, because I've been doing a pretty good job at dying in this game. So there we go. We're up to, I think, like 30-ish. I don't know what we're at with full health, but more than I have now. Aha, so I see that other dog print over there. That I think we went up there last time, so I've just got to figure out if that's actually where another dog lies. So let's go inside this little dog pr paw print thing once again. I might as well drop down a save while we're here. And let's go see if this actually leads us to another dog. So we've been to this area, of course. I'm keeping my eyes peeled for any more dog paw prints here. And health upgrades for that matter to see if we find anything that I missed last time. 
Uh, okay, well, let's kill this guy. I've got my machine gun upgraded to full, so it's pretty good right now. Oh, he's gonna get out. Well, that goes, there goes that being upgraded. Is there any dog over here at all? I'll just keep looking, guys. Yeah, I don't see anything over here, guys, so I guess we're just gonna go back. I'm back in the Sand Zone residence, and I go inside here, and there is a dog, but I can't take them with me, so I'm not sure if that's an important dog or if there's nothing we can do here. I feel like I'm not going to have to backtrack anymore to get the dogs. I could be totally wrong, but let's try just moving forward again and see if there's anything I missed in the forward moving, uh, moving paths. I mean, this right here says the Sand Zone Warehouse is to the east, and that's where the red flowers are at, I think. So we probably should go there, but I feel like the dogs are going to be important to like get the key to that or something to that extent. So I'll just keep looking. Oh my gosh, one of the dogs is just randomly in the sand over here. How did I not realize that was there? Oh, maybe because they run away from me. So we're going to have to trap this guy down. Get back here, you little crud. That guy is fast as heck. I don't know if there's any way we can sprint here. Let's just see if he's getting trapped. Get over. Oh, uh, no, I tried to talk to him. I don't know if that's what we have to do, but I'm going to try. Okay, there we go. Do you want to bring him along? Yeah, let's go bring this dog back. After this, there should just be one more. Here you go. Here's another dog. You are the popular one. My dogs aren't very fond of troublemakers either. I really do appreciate all your hard work so far. Gave her the dog. Is it the warehouse key that you're after? Yes, that same warehouse that contains all the red flower seeds in it. It doesn't matter to me who you are, understand? I can't give you the key to the warehouse. Sorry. Opening the warehouse, that would be foolishly allowing an encore of the same tragedy from before. One, two, three, and four. Only one more to go. We'll have to see if she lightens up and gives us the key if we get her last dog, but let's just see how it goes. I can't seem to find where the last dog is. I have a guess, and my guess is that that one dog back in the Sand Zone residence will now come with us now that we've got all the other dogs, so I'm gonna go try that out and see if that works. If not, there's probably just some random dog hanging out somewhere. Here we go, let's test out if this works. Arf. No, he's still not going to come with us, so either this is not a dog we have to get, or there's some trick to getting him. Maybe if we do something in here. Uh, well, he's looking at me, but that's about it. I don't have any kind of bone or any kind of thing to attract him, so... Oh! What the heck? Okay, maybe there's a secret up here. What am I doing in here, dude? I can go in there, but I don't see anything to do in here. Aha! The power of gunfire! We can see right up here is another path. Uh... Okay, let's just try to figure out where exactly we're going here. Looks like we can go down. Oh! What the heck is over here? Alright, uh... What? Ah! Oh! Okay, I can kind of go into the wall here. I don't think this is the right way to be going. Trying to see if there's any other paths. No? Crud. What in the crud? I have just found some Curly's panties. Or whoever Curly is. I don't know who that is, but... Well, I have found some panties. <laughs> okay. Alright, my dude, you want to follow me now that I've got panties? I guess not. What do I do with these? Uh, let's go talk to the girl. Maybe that's Curly. Hey, I found your panties! This is all the human's fault. The Mimigar are just being used. No, I don't I don't know who Curly is, and I don't know what to do with those. Oh my gosh, I just talked to a Mimigai here. If you go to her house, referencing the old lady Janka, you should take that dog next to the bed and look in the next room. I think talking to that specific guy is the trigger here. Yep, okay, now we can take this dog with us. We just had to talk to the thing. But on the bright side, my exploration of this room, trying to get the dog to come with me, led to me finding some panties. So we're in a pretty good place. Now let's go back, take the final dog, and see if we can get that warehouse key. All right, here we go. Oh, and Balrog's back. I have the warehouse key. All righty then, see, I kind of need that. As long as he leaves the door unlocked behind him. Wait! Oh, off he goes. What do you do with all the dogs? Uh, well, I got the last dog here for you. Oh, it's you. Heck yeah, it's me. Can I have the key? I mean, he was just joking about taking it, right? Well, gave her the dog. The key. The key to the warehouse was stolen by Balrog. Please stop them. They'll unleash rabid Mimiga possessed by the red flower against the surface. Unless there's more that they've stolen. I think there's only six Mimiga left, so I don't think it'll be that much to deal with. But maybe they're just that vicious. Please take this with you. And we get a life pot. Um, is this like Zelda? Can we carry a fairy with it? Use it and your life will be fully restored. Oh, it's like a potion, but just once. Oh crud, just once? Alright guys, well I've been playing for a little over half an hour. I think the video is probably way shorter than that because I was looking around quite a lot. But, we found all the dogs, we've got our next little sequence here. We've got to go and find Balrog and get the warehouse key or whatever. I guess next time we'll try to go in the warehouse and see if he left it unlocked. So, I'll see you guys next time. Take care.